Sure am glad I have a metal detector right now. I just spent five minutes looking for it. It's changing my my SD card in my camera and I dropped my freaking memory card. I looked and looked and looked. I'm like, wait a second. I might be able to hit it with my detector. I tried my pin pointer for a minute and I couldn't find it. And I finally used the simplex there, swept around here and I finally was getting a really choppy tone right there, right there. There's my SD card. Don't want to lose that, right? Don't want to lose that. So I was keeping it in my pocket here. My batteries and my SD cards, I keep in my pocket there. Now I can't remember what I pulled out of there. Did I pull my target out? No, I don't. I don't know what I'm doing, man. Did I already get it out? No, I didn't. That's some can flaw. It's probably a nail. I can't remember what I was, what I was, uh, I'm in the relic dump here, so. I can't remember if I even extracted it out yet. Just give me some wire. Yeah, it's gonna be some wire right there. It's some iron. But that might not be it. I can't remember what I was digging up here. Because it took me so long to change my battery out. Or my I changed my battery and my my SD card, then I dropped my SD card when I was putting it in my my packet there. That's why I always I'm always on the ground. I'm always on the ground when I change my, my SD card and my battery so I don't lose stuff, you know, so it doesn't like drop, fall on me and fling over somewhere, you know. But um, I'm gonna put this plug back in there and see if, if, see if that was it. I forgot what I was digging up. Yeah, it's probably that wire. But I'm gonna reel up the dump here. Let's continue this video here. I'm at full gain. It's doing pretty good. It's doing pretty good. I'm liking it. It's just so much heavier. It's so much heavier than the other coils. This this coil is very heavy. I don't know what it what it is about it. It just it feels heavy. But it does very good. I like it. I like it. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a. Uh, it's probably a couple nails touching each other. Square nails. There's a lot of those square nails here, man. There's gobs of them, man. Some foil right there. No, it's not foil. I'm not thinking. Oh, it's deep. Oh man, this is not good. It was giving me some four tones. Zero four. It's some iron. It's uh. It's some junk down there. I can feel it. Yeah. There's just a lot of big iron here, man. Man, there's a lot of big iron here. But this is where you're gonna be using the, this coil at, you know? You trash your spots. What's it gonna be? Is it gonna be a horseshoe right there? I think so. I see a horseshoe coming out right there. See that right there? horseshoe man I think so just give me some weird tones to it though I'll just dig it out of here scrape it out I don't know which way it's going so I don't want to break it because it looks like a race horseshoe extract it out here it's right there go really easy oh I'm gonna break it if I try to pry on it like that Right there. Okay, come on, baby. 
Let it be a full horseshoe. Come on, baby. Is that the rest of it? Oh, it's all. No, that's not the rest of it. Okay. If I can get underneath that here without breaking it. Oh man, I'm gonna break it if I try to do that. I'll just extract it here. Okay, here we go. We're popping it, pop it out. Oh, it's not a horseshoe, man. It's something else. What the heck is it? What the heck is that for? Hmm. I'm not really sure about that one. Might be some kind of implement for a tractor or something. I'm not really sure about that. Okay, a lot of iron here. It, it kind of didn't look like a horseshoe too because it was it, it got really thick right here real fast and there's no cleat on it. Usually horseshoes have a cleat right there on the end of them, a cleat. I think that's what it's called, the cleat. Darn, I, think, I thought I had a horseshoe there, man. My first horseshoe with the Simplex five by nine and a half. But I do have a, a huge chance to get horseshoes here. I found two big ones. I'll go down a little bit on the game. Okay. Cover that hole up a little better. Ooh. I'm getting a good tone this way. So I'm gonna dig it out. You can see what we got here. A lot of relics in this dump, so hasn't I haven't really worked a lot of hours in this dump yet. But I found a lot of cool relics already. In it. Is that it right there? No. I don't think so. Oh, left my pinch one on. What the heck is that? Right there. Is that it? No. Come on, baby. Oh, it's a button, man. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, lovely. Oh, yeah. I don't know if it's a button. No, I don't think that's a button. Don't think it's going to be a button. No. It might be. Just a weird one. It's old, though. Yeah, I think it's like an upholstery button or something. Because it has that clip on it. Yeah, it's an upholstery button. It's still good though. I'll take that. Another button in my collection right there. Really scratchy tone. Wasn't giving me a very good response from this smaller coil, but it's a really trashy spot. And I didn't find it with my other coils, with my other machines, so. But on different days, you find different stuff. I'm gonna go down one more bar to four bars. That sounding, that sounding actually really good. Ooh, it's really woody here. A lot of big tree roots down there. Oh, this is gonna be hard to get out. Oh man, I don't know about this one. <laughs> There's a huge rut right there, man. Right in the center of this blood here. <laughs> I don't know about this one. <laughs> yeah. There's this one. This might not be coming out. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, it's right there on the side of the rut. I'm gonna get it out. Oops. Going really careful with it. I don't want to destroy it if it's something cool. Going really easy with it. 
Ah, it's deep. Shut this thing up here. Okay. Going in on it. Okay. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, I'm right to it. See where the roots at. I don't want to destroy it. Oh, right there. I'm right on it. Right here. It's gonna pop right out. Right there. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah. See, I was missing stuff. Missing the stuff with my other coils, but it is a different day, different conditions, different detector, different coil. I've gotten a lot of relics out of this dump, so they just keep keep on going and hunting your sights, man. If you're finding stuff, you're just gonna keep on finding more for a long time. There's some glass right on the top of the soil that I just put back in there. This is a really iffy, big time iffy one here. Kind of sounds like a nail or something. But it's right next to roots, so you're not gonna get very good targets next to roots. Or you're not gonna get very good tones next to roots. It could be something really good like that right there. A little bit of iron. Part of a lock or chain or something. Yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about, man. This is what I like about metal detecting. You're guaranteed to at least get something trash or something good. Like, let's say for fishing, you, I've been fishing all day long, haven't gotten a single freaking bite, man. Metal detecting, you're guaranteed to at least get something like some foil or a pull tab or a zinc penny or something. That's what I like about metal detecting, man. You just never know what you're gonna find. I love fishing too, man, I love fishing. But metal detecting is really such a great exercise for me. And it keeps my mind off depression and anxiety, you know? Oh yeah. Right there. Iffy. A uh, little bit too, uh, let me, I'm gonna jack it up all the way. I'm digging this one out. Oh, it's gonna be hard. Oh, oh man. Oh, boy. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be very deep. I just don't think it's gonna be very deep, to tell you the truth. Oh, dude, that sounds killer, man. Oh, what the, could this be, man? That sounds awesome, man. Oh, it sounds so good, man. Oh, oh, oh. It's gotta be something big iron. Some old stuff here. Come on, baby. It's gonna be my first horseshoe. Oh, yeah. I don't, it doesn't sound like a horseshoe. I've never found a horseshoe with this coil yet, so. I'm not having really too high hopes for, oh, it's a nail. Right there. Oh, look at that beautiful square nail. That's a beautiful square nail. There's a lot of them here, but that one's a nice one. I'll actually keep that one, thank you very much. Put that one in my collection. Ooh, is there another one down there? Just like it? Ooh, I think so. I'll shut it up. Use that mute button, man, when I can. Oh, come on, baby. Oh, I feel something else down there. I do feel something else down there.
right there it's a nut no it's not a nut what am i thinking it's another square nail man yeah dude square nails man okay that's what it was two square nails they make tones like that you know it wasn't a very good response from the detector because it only give me a one-way target there you know but it sure did sound awesome when i pulled that plug huh <laughs> a lot of square nails here It's liking it. It's liking it at full, full gain here. It's liking it a lot. I'm very impressed with this new coil here. It sounds nice and stable, right? If I drop it down one bar. drop it down to two bars two bars here see how it's clipping out a lot there i don't like that because it's already detecting at this sensitivity of that this gain here it's already detecting those nails to begin with and all the relics in this dump right here are the same level in the dirt the same plane in the dirt as the square nails so it doesn't matter what sensitivity i have 